Here's a second version or second prototype I've done of this press that I've been working on. Uh, it has a few upgrades from the first one. It now has thrust washers here made out of bronze. It also has bushings over these bolts also of bronze. Here's a view of individual parts. And then there's also a bronze bushing for the ram here and it's cut to fit the diameter of this ram there are two link holes up top here right now this one gives it more force uh, the other link hole will give full stroke right now the stroke is limited somewhat the handle has been modified to be adjusted right now it's on its shortest setting there's holes all along the inner portion here and you can adjust the handle in about four different locations so right now it's on the shortest uh, setting so it'll take a little more force right now I'm sizing 45 caliber bullets these are about 459 roughly powder coated they're 45 uh, 270 SAA from an M and P brass mold. These are wheel weights and linotype. One one coat of powder coat on here. Here's some more of those. This sizing die was cleaned with brake cleaner, and I don't have any lube on these bullets. I prefer to use corn, uh, Hornady one shot case lube. It makes it much smoother. But to test this press. I wanted to run them dry and make sure that it works out properly. So these are going from 459 down to 451.3. I'll run this bullet here. It takes a little bit of force, but it's not bad. When I ran this same type of bullet through here, with the link set to give it full throw, it took more force. If I extended out the handle, of course, it would be easier. Um, the lube makes it run much better, but some people may not choose to do that. This model isn't powder coated yet. It will be powder coated like the previous one. The shape has been changed somewhat. And the hardware may get upgraded a little bit here to look better. Uh, Again, this one is a prototype, so it's not quite finished and ready to go out. This is a roller handle here. And if I can find some decent hardwood, I may use that. This um, might be a birch that's on here. And then eventually I may make up something to mount under the press and hold these short acro bins.